Hello, welcome to Engineer's Mindset. Now let's say I'm giving this problem. If A is equal to I minus 3J plus 2K and B equals to minus I minus J minus K and C equal to 2I plus 6J plus 9K, which one says evaluate the following. First is to evaluate A plus B plus C. Okay, so let's start with the first one. Solution. I have asked to evaluate A plus B plus C. It might, all, it might also interest you to know that this is actually A plus B plus C. It's still the same thing regardless of the brackets. Okay, so to carry out this, um, we put in the values of the vectors. Vector A is I minus 3J plus 2K. So in place of A, I have I minus 3J plus 2k so this is vector a okay plus vector b vector b is simply minus i minus j minus k okay and then finally plus vector c is 2i okay plus 6j okay uh, plus 9 Okay. Alright, so in the previous video, I said that you can only add vectors when you move in the same direction. So if they are not moving in the same direction, it's very much impossible to add them. Now, from this uh, question, we see that i minus i and 2i are all in the same direction. So these are the ones you can add in terms of the i. Okay, so we have that a plus b. So C is actually, so we start with the I's, vectors in the I direction. We have I, which is I, okay, minus I, okay, minus I, okay, and then plus 2I, plus 2I, okay, this is for the I direction. The next to add is J, so here we have minus 3J, minus J, and plus 6j okay so we have plus minus 3j okay here is minus j so you have minus j okay and here is um, plus 6j plus 6j so you have this okay and finally we add all the k's together so we have uh, here plus 2k, so plus 2k, here we have minus k, minus k, and here we have plus 9k, plus 9k, with the bracket. So a plus b plus c is actually i minus i plus 2j, i minus i will cancel out to 0, so you are left with plus 2 I. So this is I and not J. Um, so this is I and this is I. Okay, this is I. So I minus I is all, so your left is plus 2I. Okay, and then minus 3J minus J will give us minus 4J because minus and minus. Uh, minus 1, minus 3 minus 1 is actually minus 4. So minus 3j minus j gives us minus 4j. Minus 4j plus 6j will give us 2j. You might as well want to point your capital to get that correct. Okay, but this will give us plus 2j. Okay, and then finally 2k minus k is actually 1k. 1k plus 9k will give us 10k. So plus 10 Okay, so the addition of those three vectors will give us this value. So that's the final answer to the first um, problem. The next problem says we should find B. Okay, I I says we should find B plus 2 A to A minus 3 C. Okay, so this is a little bit tricky but not difficult. If you decide to expand these brackets, let's say we we'll expand this bracket, we are going to have B plus 2 times a will give us 2a minus 2 times minus a will give us minus um, 6c. So this is what they are actually asking us to evaluate. 
Okay, B plus then use this two to expand the brackets. Plus two times A, this was plus two A, plus two times minus AC will give us minus six because two times A is six, and then minus is over than and plus, so we have minus six C. So this is what we are asked to find. Okay, so let's break, let's uh, do this in details. First of all, let's find um, two A. Let's find two A. Two A simply means two multiplied by vector A. And vector A is here. We have I minus A J um, plus two K. So this gives us vector A. So therefore, two A is actually two times I gives us two I. 2 times j gives us minus, sorry, 2 times minus 3j gives us minus 6j. 2 times plus 2k gives us plus 4k. So it means now that 2a is equal to this. The next thing we'll do is to evaluate what 6c. So let's find what 6c is. Okay, 6c is now equal to 6 multiplied 3 by the value of vector c. And vector C gives us 2i, okay, plus 6j, okay, and plus 9k. Alright, so 6c is now equal to, we expand, 6 by 2i gives us 12i. 6 by 6j gives us plus 6j. And then 6 by 9 gives us 24 Okay, alright, so that's where I get up to point that uh, to see how correct it is. But this is actually value for 6c. Okay, so after getting this, we now plug into the equation. The equation says we find b plus 2a minus 6c. Okay, so we now have that b plus 2a minus 6c is now equal to, uh, okay, equal to first to break that thing plus b. Because B is given to us as minus I minus J minus K. So vector B is actually minus I minus J minus K. Okay, we'll bring it out. Then let's say is 2A plus 2A. So plus, we'll compare 2A because 2A gives us this 2I, okay, uh, minus 6J and plus 4. Okay, this is vectors 2a plus vectors uh, minus, okay, this is minus, so you have minus uh, 6c, 6c gives us, gives us this 4i, okay, plus 36j, okay, and then plus 54k. So please think you'll get minus sign that b plus 2a. This is B plus this is 2A and minus 6C. So put down the minus. Okay, so let's evaluate this and see what we are going to have. So just like in effect, let's first of all expand this bracket and see. So we have minus I, minus J, minus K. Okay, this is plus 2I, minus 6J, plus 4K. Now, with minus expands this bracket, we have minus times 4 give us minus 12i, minus times plus give us minus 36j, minus times plus 54 gives us minus 54k. Okay, we will have here, so like I said, vectors can only add when they move in the same direction. So it means that i will only add with i and j will only add with j. If you have k, you only add with k. Okay, so that simply implies now that we have um, minus i. Now we bring all the i terms together. Minus i um, plus 2i. Okay, this is plus 2i plus 2i. And then we have minus 12g. Minus 12g. Okay, we'll have this. Also, we bring all the j terms together plus we have minus j. So minus j. Um, minus 6j, minus 6j, and then finally minus 36j, minus 36j, okay? And finally, plus, bring all the k times together, we have minus k here, minus k, 
we have plus 4k plus 4k and then finally minus 54k okay so that means that this problem b plus 2 into a minus 3c is now equal to minus i plus 2i is actually i okay i minus 12i I keep on writing i and j sorry forgive me sorry it's actually 2i not 12 sorry 2i okay is actually 2i minus i plus 2i so it's plus forgive me please it's plus minus i plus 2i okay and then minus okay sorry i'm sorry minus 12j minus 12i correct minus 4i okay minus 4i so minus i plus 2i is actually plus 1i plus 1i minus 12i will give us minus 11i okay also minus j minus 6j is minus 7j minus 7j plus 6j will give us minus um, will give us minus um, 43j so we have minus 43j okay that will give us minus 43j and finally minus k plus 4k is actually 3k 3k minus 54k will give us minus 51k so we have minus 51k all right so this becomes the answer to that other problem finally we are asked to evaluate 2a minus b minus c okay so you have that's the third problem says evaluate 2a minus um, b minus c if we expand this bracket let me confirm okay yeah so if we expand this bracket with the minus sign um, you have that um, this implies that 2a minus multiplied by b gives us minus b minus multiplied by minus c gives us plus c so this is what the actual to evaluate in this case and this is equal to we already obtained the value for 2a and 2a was given to us as this 2i minus 6j plus 4k so in place of 2k we we'll have 2i minus 6j plus 4k okay you have that and then next is minus b minus b b is was minus i minus j minus k okay so minus b which is minus i minus j minus k and finally plus c and our c gives us the equation c is equal to 2i plus 6j plus 9k so we have 2i plus 6j plus 9k all right so if we expand this bracket we are going to have um this is 2i minus 6j plus 4k okay let's expand the minus sign minus multiplied minus turns to plus i minus multiplied minus turns to plus k minus by minus turns to plus k okay. so you have this okay then plus uh, 2i plus 6j plus 9k all right so that plus only are when they are in the same direction so bring all the i's together therefore 2a plus a minus b uh, minus c is now equal to we have 2i okay plus i and um, plus 2i all in the same direction plus we bring all the j down together we have 6j uh, 6j okay okay sorry we have plus j okay minus 6j minus 6j okay minus 6j plus j okay and then plus 6j and then finally plus Finally, we have k terms. Uh, we have plus 4k, okay, 4k plus k, and then plus 9k. We have this, okay. So 
it means now that 2a minus b minus c is now equal to 2i plus i plus 2i will give us 5i. So we have 5i. Okay? Uh, minus 6j plus j minus 6j will give us plus j because minus 6j plus 6j comes up your left plus j and then finally 4k plus 1k plus 9k will give us 14 plus 14k all right so that's the answer to this, that uh, last uh, question which is it all right guys i will see you in the next video with another amazing question on vectors. In the meantime, if you are new to the channel, don't fail to subscribe and also share the video for more subscribers. Thanks and cheers.